hello friends welcome back to my channel today in this video i am going to share uh, one real time requirement which is requested by one of our subscriber so i am making this video okay so what happens in real time that uh, user want to download an excel template they don't want to create it manually so they will ask uh the business the business will ask to create uh, an option to download an excel template like this you can see here in this excel template there are only four columns but what happens uh, basically uh, in case of uh, bdc or bapi in the sap abap what happens uh, in case of bdc you need to uh, upload an excel file okay in case of bapi also you need to upload a um, excel file so there are only four columns for now but there will be 50 60 columns will be uh, there as per business requirement so at that time user don't want to create uh, and put the columns names manually 60 open an excel file and write the uh, 60 columns at a time so they don't want to do that they want a uh, automatic template okay so uh, for that to create that an abapper need to write a logic to download that template into an excel format so that user will directly use that template uh, put the data and uh, upload it okay i hope you all got my point okay so this is the basically the selection screen i just took uh, a sample screenshot okay and you can see here one button is there in, on the selection screen that is download template button we can give uh, any name okay once we click on this or once user click on this button then an excel file will be open you can see here uh, like this an excel file will open and when we open this excel file it will look like this for now we you can see here four columns but in real time scenario it might be 50 60 or uh, 10 15 as well as per business requirement okay so uh, you need to develop this code okay so this is the code you can see here okay this is the selection screen code for the template okay you can see here this code is for this template hmm. this much then at uh, in the add selection screen event you can write this logic meaning uh, from this to this these four lines okay then you can uh, write inside this a statement you can write this subroutine perform download and once this perform will call then this form and form will be called form download then this logic will be called okay so you you need to write this logic whenever you want to um, implement in your requirement okay i'll remove the space here okay no worry it's not taking okay you can stop the uh, uh, you can pause the video and uh, you can write this code selection screen part then add selection screen event then for the perform uh, download for this form and form will be called and in this form download you can write this much of code I am scrolling down one by one. You can pause the video and uh, get this logic. Here you can add column names column 1, column 2, column 3, column 4 
if you have suppose 10 15 columns in the column names then you can add more after this okay you can write this you can give the field name here and uh, you can add the column name as per your requirement and this in the same way for the GWA format for the GWA format you can see for the GWA format type is TY format and in this if you check the TY format uh, structure you can see the four column names here so if you want to add more columns then put enter write your field name here suppose ABC with the length of 20 okay you need to add here then uh, in okay once you add here then it will automatically applicable for this GWA format and you can write here below GWA underscore format hyphen field name is ABC equal to column number 5 like this you can add your number of columns okay I am scrolling down you can pause the video and get this logic this is the end this is the end page okay so this is the entire logic for this download template in sap abap so you can get this for reference thanks for watching this video